Good morning, everyone. It's bright and early this morning. The sun is out and it's shining bright. And it is the coldest morning of the year so far. What is the temperature? Well, you can see my breath that it's cold. Let's take a look and see what the temperature is this morning. 19 degrees. All right, so the first thing I have to do is put all of my canning rings away in my canning garage, which is nice and clean. Looks good. Looking very good, I'm keeping it clean. Because it is so cold out, I am stripping the bedding and I'm hanging it on the line. You got the pillows out on the line and now I got to do put the bedding out. Okay I'm almost afraid it's too cold for my camera but let me just show you the front of the house the sun. Oh it's so nice and bright. Garden is put to bed. I have my tea towels hanging out already. So they're hanging out. People always ask me two things. How in the world can you hang your wash on the line and have it dry when it's so cold? You only need one of two things. You either need the sun or you need some wind or airflow and your wash will dry. It freeze dries and so probably by two o'clock in the afternoon everything will be dry and oh the scent is amazing when you crawl into bed especially when it's really cold like this all right I want to get this hung up and turn my camera off because it is really cold it's almost I'm afraid it's too cold for my camera all right see you in a little bit You know, some of the best parts in life are things that are free, like memories and hanging clothes on the line. It's all free, and that's some of the best parts of life. I want to see if the hook is holding. I've been having some issues with this wash line because this tree is dead. All right, it seems to be holding. Let's go in the house, it's so cold. Now it was time to make some lunch and hubby and I decided to take all of you guys suggestions and make the egg casserole. As you've seen in videos back before, we made the muffin egg casserole and people were telling me they think it would be really good to make it in a 9 by 11 inch pan. So hubby said, let's give it a try. And so we made the same casserole, but using it in a 9 by 11 inch pan instead of the little muffin tins. Now, one thing we did observe was the bread seemed to get a little more soggier this way, but after letting it sit in the refrigerator for an extra day after it was cooked, it became so much better. In fact, we really liked making it this way. It is so much easier doing it. So what you're seeing here is it's bread and onions and peppers and all kinds of wonderful, nutritious vegetables and then we add egg with water a little bit of milk and we pour that on top and then we have cheese if you want the recipe I will share with you at the end of this video will be that video so you need to wait to the end of this video to see the icon to click on the video of where we're making it originally but it was really good and you can freeze it as well so let's finish up this egg casserole and let's eat some lunch and then we have to finish 
working on the day. It's the end of the day. It's about four o'clock and by five o'clock it's dark. Putting everything away. It was a good day. I got a lot of stuff done. But I am ready to relax. Always putting canning jars away. Always getting canning jars back out again. Now I have to burn my trash. A lot of people don't realize that part of rural life is burning trash and doing things like that. So what I do is I burn my paper and my cardboard. Now I do compost some of it, but if I have enough or too much, then I'll burn it. It's so nice because I don't rely on having municipal, you know, trash collecting and all of that. So I gotta go and work on this yet. I burn trash maybe twice a week, not even that anymore, because I don't really have that much trash that I used to. And all of my wash that we hung out early this morning is dry. So I have to go and get that down. and asked me about burning trash. Just about all of our neighbors do. Not all of them, but over half of them, they burn their own trash too. And I try to do it before it's too late into the evening. All right, that's done. Now I'll go ahead and get the wash off the line, make the bed, clean up the dishes. People often ask about my clothesline. This one here, I got on Amazon. I do have one from Layman's too but this one is what i've been using now for the last couple years and i really like it it is the kit it's the same kit that that layman sells so it is the kit that layman sells but amazon also sells it it's pretty reasonable all right that's done i'm gonna go in make the bed <sighs> i don't think there's anything else i have to do i can't think Everyone, I'm each in the bedroom and I gotta clean up my bedroom and make the bed.